Hello everyone, my name is Marcus G. Welcome to my channel. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. Many viewers of Sister Wives have begun to speculate that Cody Brown may have made a deal with TLC to safeguard his reputation. Listening to the episodes again makes it seem like the family is being protected by an arrangement of some kind. In particular, many feel that TLC is holding back from delving further because to the caution shown during the tell-alls. Several of the changes and omissions are particularly revealing. An anonymous Reddit user writes, a theory about why the tell all slash one-on-ones are so sucky. In reference to sister wives, the user continues by inserting a point on the family and Cody Brown reaching an agreement. A first-time viewer, I have just completed. What annoys me the most about the tell-alls and one-on-ones is that nobody ever calls out bad behavior or outright lying. The footage is already in their possession, and they could even spin the reels. My belief is that Cody, in an ironic twist, gotta love karma, negotiated or demanded that TLC include a clause in their contracts protecting the family's reputation. Please tell me why TLC isn't better at this if this isn't the case. I'd love an explanation, haha. <laughs> the only footage that comes close to revealing the truth is the season 18 talkback episodes, so thank goodness for that. It began to seem like the entire family was trying to avoid the probing questions by negotiating a less confrontational host, the viewer said, regarding the first few seasons. Another absurdity is that they are not need to be physically present in the same room to answer questions. Nobody calls them out on their bullshit. At the very least, there would be responsibility if they were physically there with one another, in my opinion. Many viewers praised Tamron Hall for her forthright questions and her ability to get responses from Cody Brown and the other sister wives family members during the debate. The ones with Tamron Hall were fantastic. She coerced Cody into answering her questions and wouldn't budge. I completely agree with you on this. I can see they've gotten sloppy. The editing is bad enough that they use subpar mobile phone footage and don't even attempt to add music to make the show entertaining. All of that was once theirs. There is plainly no effort, and at least a quarter of the exhibit is just recycled material. Hey, but there are Sister Wives viewers who just can't get their heads around the idea that Cody Brown has a provision protecting his portrayal on the show. In particular, because his monster persona has been prominent over the past two seasons. Some think the family had to give up their rights to what was in the final edit since the show was in danger of cancellation. Because he looks so bad in the new seasons, I don't believe that Cody enlisted TLC to safeguard their reputation. So far as my watch through has taken me, there are issues with him throughout seasons 1 to 7, but he is portrayed as a flawed but likable character overall. In seasons 17 and 18, he's pretty much a monster, haha. <laughs> However, some people think Cody Brown is too domineering for them to ever come to an agreement. It is my belief that Cody included certain contractual safeguards. Because he is a control freak, he would like it if his family had a good reputation. Even though the family gets to watch episodes before anybody else, they don't get to decide what's in the episodes. However, the revealers, Cody, so the rumor goes, has no idea why his reputation is so tarnished. His actions are deeply troubling and disturbing, and I don't think he realizes it. I don't know if anyone else shares my lack of familiarity with the culture and polygamy. We don't see Cody the way he sees himself. Because of his horrific actions, persistent deceit, and gaslighting, we consider him a monster. Despite all of his bad behavior, such as financially abusing his wives and children, Cody still considers himself a wonderful man. Do you have any opinions? Is Cody Brown's family protected by an arrangement with TLC? Are you of the opinion that the sister wives tell-alls could benefit from more thoughtful questions? Use the sister wives area to leave a comment. Christine Brown flaunts curvaceous legs on the beach. An admirer of sister wives once told her that she could bring David Woolley and Joy into her life just by visualizing them. She did this after posting a lovely photo of herself and her spouse at Punta Cana, 
Dominican Republic. It seems like Christine Brown and Janelle had a fantastic time in Punta Cana while they were there recently. Having a blast at beautiful beaches and frolicking on ATVs was a guarantee. Savannah tagged along too. Maybe she also joins her mom's multi-level marketing company, Plexus. Fans of Sister Wives saw Cody's ex-third wife's thin legs on the beach when they were there. The TLC star and David Woolley were spotted on the beach in a recent Instagram post. It was a beautiful shot with palm palms, the ocean, and a beautiful sunrise. David cradled his wife in his arms as they stood in the center. She sported a pair of shoeless shorts, a peach-colored blouse, and a verdant skirt. Fans couldn't agree more that her long, thin legs complemented her figure. During our recent trip to Punta Cana, which we won, my friend at David Woolley woke me up to go capture a dawn photo with palm palms on the beach. Some Citrix speculated that Christine Brown may have gained weight, despite the fact that she continues to show off her thin legs. She may have been less vigilant about those pesky pounds coming on since she was pleased. Surely her posture could have had a role. The majority of admirers remarked on the couple's radiant happiness. Still, some remarks regarding her weight made it in. People will always find something negative to say, but comments like these more than make up for it. Visuals speak louder than words. What a warm and comforting snapshot of the two of you. Is it just me, or does Christine Brown appear to be much more carefree when she's with David Woolley? In awe of her slender legs, are you? Share your thoughts in the space provided, and be sure to check back for any updates regarding sister wives. In preparation for their wedding, Christine Brown also began a weight loss regimen. The sister wives actress is facing frustration on her weight loss journey, even though she has been posting photos of her smaller body on social media. She is not dissatisfied with her progress thus far, even though she is frustrated. Every day, she exercises. Someone close to the Sister Wives actors revealed that she is quite committed to the hot mom comeback thing. David believes she's picture perfect and she's proud of her progress. From what we can tell, the Sister Wives do is doing great. The couple's success is encouraging, given the public scrutiny that marriages receive, particularly in reality, provide your opinion. David Woolley has lost a lot of weight. What do you think? Is there anything else he did that contributed to his weight loss? Would it be healthy to lose 20 pounds in a few of months? Did Christine Brown actually feel envious when her husband lost a lot of weight? Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my fast gossip to our channel and stay with us.